let's suppose I'm at a networking event or I get invited to a great festival mm -hmm. and it's a mixer. So someone says, hey, so you write, may I see your work? And I know it's probably not ready. What's the best way to let them know that where sure. I'm not hurting their feelings? Where oh, they feel sure. Like it's I'm a great not... question. I would say that, oh, that's fantastic. Can I get your card? Uh, I'm, I'm doing revisions and I'd love to send it to you when it's ready. Oh, so just and can I drop know. you an e you know can I drop you an email as a reminder when it's ready? Sure, that'd be great. Oh, great! So you're not waiting a year for the revision. You're keeping them in your mind or in their mind. Sorry, right. you're, you're saying hi. I met you. You know, and thank exactly. you exactly. And you know what? It could be a year if that's if that's really what it takes. Uh, to me, it's ready when it's ready. Um, so, and it could be, I met you a year ago at the, at Sundance, and I mentioned a sci-fi uh, one-hour drama that I have, and I finally have it ready, and it's been vetted, and actually, I don't even know if I would go into all that detail, but said, I mean, I, and here's the brief premise, very, very briefly, executives don't want a whole big um, description because they also can be liable. They don't want to hear ideas in too much detail because they're not allowed to accept them for legal reasons. But if it's someone that you have met, and just to give them a refresher, this is the sci-fi one-hour pilot about uh, an alien who comes to Earth. And, <laughs> Uh, can I send it to you? And they'll either respond and say, great, or they might say no. Uh, that also, there's another subject, which is uh, submission release forms, because a lot of executives and agents will not take material without a submission release form, unless it's being, if it's, this is if it's not being submitted by an agent or manager. Interesting. Yeah, I wonder if people really understand that when mm -hmm. people see, and I've seen it on tw people's Twitter bios. I do not take, you know, mm -hmm. I, I see it all the time. So, I, and I, for a newbie, I, I do think they realize the implications and, and how it's a turnoff to when someone says no like that, there's reasons why. Right. It's not because they, are, they, they don't think your idea is good, it's because they're protecting themselves. Right. So then there are ways around to try and bypass that. Um, and yeah, that would, would probably fall under a whole conversation sure. about networking and submission policies. Right. But, but for someone to respect that when they see that someone says, we do not take blind yes. submissions. Okay. Yeah. Well, a good counter can be, um, I'd be happy to sign a submission release form. And okay. as I say that, my uh, you know, d uh, disclaimer is that as I'm saying this, I am not an entertainment attorney. Sure. So whoever may be listening, if you get a submission release form, you, I advise you to show it to an entertainment attorney. Sure. Uh, and it is up to you to decide whether to sign it or not. But that is a way around um, uh, that legality of them not wanting to accept it at all.